Elon just delayed the biggest AI model ever made, and the reason why will blow your mind. I found leaked specs showing 6 trillion parameters, 200,000 GPUs, and a 10% chance of hitting AGI, but here's the crazy part. Nothing official has been announced yet, and these leaks might change everything we know about the AI race. Everyone's talking about ChatGPT and Claude getting smarter, but nobody's talking about what Elon's cooking up behind the scenes. See, Grok 5 was supposed to drop by end of 2075. That deadline, gone. Now we're looking at early 2026, maybe January to March, and this isn't just some small delay. According to reports from December, Elon himself confirmed it. He said if they can just survive and keep pushing through this period, they'll beat everyone else. That's a bold claim, but it tells us something huge. The problems they're facing are massive. When a company delays something by months in AI where things move crazy fast, it means they hit a wall. They're trying to do something that's never been done before at this scale. Hey, if we haven't met already, I'm the digital avatar of Julian Goldie, CEO of SEO agency, Goldie Agency. Whilst he's helping clients get more leads and customers, I'm here to help you get the latest AI updates. Julian Goldie reads every comment, so make sure you comment below. So what's making this so hard? Let me paint you a picture. The leaked specs for Grok 5 are absolutely insane. We're talking about 6 trillion parameters. That's double the size of Grok 4. But here's where it gets wild. This thing is being trained on something called the Colossus 2 supercluster. Picture this, 200,000 NVIDIA GPUs all working together. The power draw, about one gigawatt. That's enough electricity to power a small city. I'm not kidding. Literally enough to keep the lights on for tens of thousands of homes. And get this, XAI shared publicly that they ramped up the Colossus cluster to 200,000 GPUs in just 122 days, seven months to build what might be one of the most powerful computing systems on earth. The infrastructure alone is staggering. Now you might be thinking, okay, but what does all that computing power actually do? Great question. Because raw scale means nothing unless it turns into real capabilities. And this is where Grok 5 starts to look genuinely different from everything else out there. According to XAI, Grok 5 will have real-time multimodal understanding. That's not just marketing talk. The leaks suggest it will natively support text, images, audio, and live video streams, all processed with very low lag. We're talking about less than 120 milliseconds from input to understanding. But wait until you see this. Musk's team actually showed Grok 5 watching a live 30-second drone video in real time. It identified roughly 47 different object types, analyzed traffic flow patterns, spotted potential hazards, plotted the shortest driving route, and issued warnings about dangers. All of that without any special training for that task. It just worked out of the box. That real-time video understanding is something very few AI systems can do today. Most models, even the advanced ones, treat video as a bunch of still images. They don't truly understand motion, context, and change over time the way Grok 5 apparently does. And here's another piece that sets it apart. The context window reports mention a native context length of about 1.5 million tokens. Compare that to GPT 5.2's 400,000 tokens, and you start to see the difference. Grok 5 could process in entire books, massive code bases, or hours of conversation in a single pass without losing track of earlier information. But the most fascinating part, and this is what could make or break Grok 5, is the live data integration. Unlike basically every other AI model which has a fixed training cutoff date, Grok 5 is continuously fed data from Twitter X. We're talking about over 100 million posts and videos per day being processed as part of its ongoing training. Elon has emphasized this live data approach repeatedly. The idea is that Grok 5's knowledge stays current, updating in real time as the world changes. Now here's where I need to tell you about something that can help you use AI like this to actually grow your business. If you want to learn how to save time and automate your workflows with cutting edge AI tools like Grok 5, you need to check out the AI Profit Boardroom. This is where you'll learn to scale your business, get more customers and save hundreds of hours with AI automation. We break down exactly how to use these new AI models in your business before everyone else figures it out. Links in the description. Trust me, you don't want to miss this. All right, back to Grok 5. In theory, this means you could ask Grok 5 about something that happened an hour ago and it would know. That's fundamentally different from asking ChatGPT about recent events when its knowledge stopped being updated months ago. Now, Elon also claims Grok 5 will set a new record for intelligence density per gigabyte. Essentially, they're engineering it to be more efficient and powerful per unit of compute and data than any rival. That's partly thanks to the mixture of experts' design where only a subset of those 6 trillion parameters actually 
actually activate for any given question. First up, OpenAI's GPT 5.2, which dropped in December 2025. This is currently the gold standard for professional knowledge work. It absolutely crushes tasks like coding, math, spreadsheet creation, and complex reasoning. Developers love it because it's incredibly good at using tools, code interpreters, web searching, multi-step planning. It takes text and image inputs and has a 400,000 token context window. The catch, it doesn't have native video or audio input. If you feed it a video, it treats it as a sequence of still images, and its knowledge cutoff is stuck at August 2025, so it can't tell you what happened yesterday. Then there's Google's Gemini 3 Pro, which came out in November 2025. Google designed this one for deep reasoning and broad multimodal understanding. It introduced something called Deep Think Mode, specifically for ultra long horizon problems that require extensive planning. Gemini 3 performs really well on knowledge tasks and complex problem solving across text and images. Google claims it outperforms previous models in reasoning, multimodality, and coding benchmarks. And we can't forget Anthropic's Claude Opus 4.5, also from November 2025. This model was optimized specifically for coding, planning, and what they call agentic workflows. Users say it's exceptional at deep research, creating presentations and spreadsheets and complex logical chains. Anthropic advertises it as the best model in the world for coding agents and computer use. It's incredibly efficient too. It cuts token usage by about 50% on coding tasks compared to its predecessor. But again, no special video or audio integration and no live data feeds. So here's what we're looking at. GPT 5.2 leads in coding and agentic tasks. Gemini 3 leads in cross-modal reasoning. Claude Opus 4.5 leads in coding efficiency and safety. Each has its lane. Grok 5's lane is different. It's betting everything on unprecedented scale combined with live data. If the promises hold up, it will blow past the others in terms of context size and real-time world knowledge. But those other models are already very strong at tasks like document analysis and code generation. Grok 5 will need to demonstrate clear gains to justify the enormous cost difference. There are reports suggesting users can already text a smart human, meaning chat with Grok to adjust their feed preferences. After Grok 5 arrives, we could see even more dynamic features. Picture asking Grok to summarize the current news cycle, verify whether a viral claim is true, or analyze a trending video to explain what's happening. Its real-time video comprehension could let it watch live events as they unfold and give you instant context. Basically, X users could get a much more conversational multimodal AI assistant built right into the platform. And here's where it gets really futuristic. Elon is working on Optimus robots and Neuralink interfaces. Both of those projects could eventually integrate with Grok5 to provide advanced AI capabilities in robotics and even brain computer interfaces. We're talking about a unified AI system that could potentially potentially help with everything from household tasks to medical applications. So for everyday users, this could mean more powerful assistance in chat voice and potentially physical interactions. Sounds amazing, right? But hold on, there's another side to this coin. Here's the part we need to talk about, even though it's not as exciting. All this power comes with serious risks. Analysts have raised red flags about Grok 5's real-time connection to what they call a chaotic social media stream. This is genuinely uncharted territory. Think about it. When you're continuously ingesting live user content from hundreds of millions of posts per day, you're opening the door to amplifying misinformation bias, conspiracy theories, and worse. Users should be aware that with Grok 5, the line between AI-generated content and human content gets increasingly blurry. When the AI is learning from what people post in real time, and then those people interact with what the AI generates, you create a feedback loop that could amplify both the good and the bad. This isn't about being alarmist, it's about being realistic. The potential benefits are enormous, but so are the potential downsides. Rigorous oversight will be absolutely essential. So let's wrap this up. What's the bottom line on Grok5? We're looking at a model expected to launch in 2026, likely somewhere between January and March. It's built on an absolutely massive scale. 6 trillion parameters trained on 200,000 GPUs, consuming about a gigawatt of power. The promise capabilities include a 1.5 million token context window, real-time processing of text, images, audio, and video, and continuous learning from live data streams on X and Tesla. Now here's where I need to tell you about something that can help you use AI like this to actually grow your business. If you want to learn how to save time and automate your workflows with, with cutting edge AI tools, like Grok5, you need to check out the AI Profit Boardroom. This is where you'll learn to scale your business, get more customers and save hundreds of hours with AI automation. We break down exactly how to use these new AI models 
in your business before everyone else figures it out. Links in the description. Trust me, you don't want to miss this. And if you want the full process, SOPs and 100 plus AI use cases like this one, join the AI Success Lab. Links in the comments and description. You'll get all the video notes from there, plus access to our community of 38,000 members who are crushing it with AI. This is your chance to stay ahead of the curve and learn how to implement these AI tools in your business before everyone else catches on. Don't sleep on this. Thanks for watching. Hit the like and subscribe button and I'll see you in the next one.